I'm Elsie. And I'm Debbie. And we're Two Sisters Southern Cooking. making collard greens today. Now we have done this recipe before but I figured it's time to revise it for you guys because who wants to go looking back in several years of videos especially when we have like just less than a thousand videos and try to find a collard green recipe. So these came from our garden and they're beautiful. Oh my gosh I can't wait. So we're going to go ahead and put ham hock in it or whatever else Elsie has. If she has turkey wings or whatever, we're going to go ahead and put it in there and we're going to get it all cooked up and it's going to be good, y'all. I'm going to show you what it looks like when it's done and just follow us to the stove. We'll be back. Hey, y'all. Tonight, along with our fried chicken, we're going to have some good old southern collard greens. Mm -hmm. And I have uh, smoked turkey necks to, to go in to season them with. So. We're gonna do all this on the stove, but I'm gonna put the turkey necks in now. Um, that's just over a pound of turkey necks. So come with us to the stove and we'll get started. And if you don't wanna use turkey necks, you could do neck bones, you can do you uh, can turkey do, wings, you, yeah, can do, you can do uh, ham hock, ham hock, you can do bacon. whatever, whatever your choice. But it has to be a pound at least. So. All right guys. So I moved the smoked uh, turkey necks to the side so that I have a little room to melt this butter and saute these onions. Up. As soon as it gets melted, I'll add the onions in and then I'm going to cook them for just a couple minutes, just long enough for them to get a little bit soft. Alright, I'm going to add them in. We're just gonna cook them till they sweat a little bit. This, this is a whole large onion. It produced a lot of stuff. Sure did. So we're gonna let this sit for a minute and let it come up to heat and start to cook and then we'll stir. These are sweating down really nicely. I think they're about ready for the garlic. I'm gonna put it in. And then we're only going to cook this for about one minute after that. Okay, we're ready to add our chicken broth in now. We're going to let this cook on high for about 20 minutes. And then we will add in the rest of our ingredients. This is um, cooked for 20 minutes. Now we're going to add in our water. We turned down our heat to medium and then we're going to start adding the collard greens in as well. And at the very end, we're going to add in the vinegar and the seasoning salt and the salt. It's going to be so good. I love me some good collard greens now. Mm -mm -mm. And these came from our garden, so it makes it extra special. We're gonna probably sweat these down for a little bit too, because they will decrease in size. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna add our seasonings in. Seasoned salt, black pepper, and our vinegar. Okay, we're gonna put the lid on now. We're gonna let this cook for a little over an hour and we'll show you what it looks like when it's done.
Kelsey and I'm Debbie and, and we're, we're two, two sisters, sisters Southern, Southern cooking. cooking please like share and subscribe thank you